yeah hi in this video i am going to show you on how to create a customer invoice with the foreign currency so to create the customer invoice you need to go to the ap70 so now the system show the customer invoice uh, you need to enter the customer code 001 which is our customer i am going to use and the posting date I am putting just I put as a number two. Let's say what is the exchange rate now the system is going to pick, yeah, because I don't give the same date. So I'm giving a different date in the month, or maybe I, I will give uh, let's say 10. So I enter the amount as uh, 9000, and this is a USD. And uh, just say I, I calculate the tax so actually I entered the wrong customer now I change it to the 600 and the 1001 the customer is not available so now I go to the payment tab to see the details of the payment and you can see the baseline date so I you can set the payment term and the payment time I just put them um, maybe the ZR03 which is uh, 45 days from today yeah so uh, this invoice is due uh, we need to be uh, collect uh, this amount from the customer within 45 days so under the details uh, you can put some assignment then which is the recon account is showing here yeah now uh, I go to the tax tab where you can check the tax calculated later when I enter the other line item so now the local currency so you can see the exchange rate picked by the system is 835 83857 so which is this one even though I maintained on this date uh, the, the, the if you see that I maintained on, on this date which is uh, first uh, is as my open rate for the September and the system automatically pick the date which is uh, here even though I enter 10 translation date it put the latest rate from the system yeah so then it is converted so now I'm going to enter the other leg which is for a profit and loss account so I press enter so you can see there is a um, red indicator here because if the debit and credit doesn't match you know, the system will show here is is uh, the red so now it's processing so the system shows the a, a message which is a CO object is needed CO object can be a cost center or a profitability segment so I double click on the, the error line then the system will go to the line item details uh, for this customer so now I'm going into the more uh, this is a more button where you can enter the profit center information because it's a revenue uh, GL account for the profit and loss so you can enter uh, I enter the segment as well yeah and they click OK and and what its system shows is still is not correct yeah so let's say I remove this uh, profit center and also the cost the segment so now I go to the profitability segment then the system will show another pop-up window where you can see the profitability so just uh, I'm going to click a derive uh, the profitability segment you see it's already derived and then you can analyze the derivation uh, by clicking analyze the derivation this is for the profitability uh, segment so the system show the derivation details here so the check the profit center accounting is active and uh, uh, yeah so I just click the back button so click OK
So when you check now, you are not entered anything. You derived the profitability segment from here. So the system automatically choose. This is a profit center. Now click OK. And, and, and now you can go back and you can simulate the document. So now click on simulate. Then the system will show document to be posted. Now click on uh, save button. Then the system will automatically post uh, a customer invoice you can see here. So this is how you can post a customer invoice in the financial accounting without any the sales document or anything uh, directly using uh, uh, SAP financials. Now, so um, now the system will uh, show you with uh, a document number is generated once uh, the document is uh, successfully posted and the case of uh, uh, when the customer line items. save the document then the document will be posted by the system and it will give you a document number here in the status bar um, you can see After the document successfully posted, then the system will show the document under the status bar. Status bar. This is the document posted successfully. Yeah. Thank you. This is how you can post a customer in the foreign currency.